ned til det der pump. Hvor pumpet bare bliver værre og værre. Se hvad jeg er med min egen krop. Så er det blevet tid til den største test på hele turen. Det er blevet tid til bendag sammen med Milos, så det er vores tredje træning sammen med ham. De andre har været virkelig modbydelige, så han har kæmpet for nogle rigtig klamme bentræninger, og han, han har også driller os lidt, og, og sagt, hvis vi frygte. Så jeg er spændt på, hvad han har at byde på. Jeg skal bare holde fokus, jeg skal bare overleve, og så selvfølgelig have så meget af det som muligt. Vi skal hænge på, suge en masse viden til jer, gerne hende bare gas. Der er en masse Nice bodybuilder i center lige nu, der er rigtig god stemning. Regan Grimes, en af de helt unge, kendte gutter, han er også nødt at træne. Uh, en middags også træner normalt, så uh, det er mega fedt, vi skal bare have fuld gas. Følg med. with the uh, seated 10, 9, 8, 7. How many squats? 50. I was going to do 100. My ori original idea was 100. Boom! Dude, it's heavyweight. It's power time. Four. The man is going to be a Grimes, main crush. Men det værste er, at jeg har kørt ingen grund til opvarmning, og min ben er allerede helt pumpet, så jeg ved sgu ikke rigtigt. Jeg håber, jeg har overskud til at få taget et billede med ham. Det skulle nok være sket inden træningen, desværre. Så so nobody takes the machine. Jeg skal bare stå her, det er perfekt. Bare stå bare jeg står bare og holder maskiner. Vi skal ikke bruge den her, den bruger vi. Regan træner der, han er vant til at blive træner af Miller, så vi har lige fået et billede med ham, og han griner bare så held og lykke, fordi han ved, hvordan det er på daglig basis at blive slået ihjel, så øh, ja, vi ved, hvad der ventes.
Jeg har kun kørt opvarmning med os. Det er rigtig ulækkert nu. Jeg er meget på mit ben i det sætning. Anderledes, meget irriterende smerte. Så det bare brænder helt vildt. Rotation, I'm adding the machine. Uh, adding uh, another edges. Okay? So now it's... So more weight and more exercises. Okay? But every other you can go fast. And over here you're gonna do fast. And over here you can go slow. Alright, here we go. Beautiful. I'm doing perfect. Boom. Six. Har lige sagt til os at hver rotation vi kører nu, det tilføjer en øvelse og tilføjer mere vægt. Det vil sige, at det bliver bare klammer, klammer og klammer og endnu klammer indtil vi er færdige. Så det er også en god Det er helt helt vægt der. Det er det virkelig godt. Pumpe bare bliver værre og værre Og der er kvælme Jeg kan ikke være med min egen krop Jeg kan ikke sige noget Jeg har ikke noget at sige Det er alt hvad jeg har at sige til den her træning Tak fordi I så med Vi kommer ikke til at lave flere lignende videoer Det er slet ikke sjovt det her jeg bruger al min tid i Las Vegas på det her lort. Er det ikke uh, det trick, Joss? Vi, vi, jo, vi tror vi kunne have været på casino lige nu. Ja, vi skulle have været det. i vandland lige nu. Vi kunne have været i vandland lige nu, mand.
Oh, yeah. No, not today. Second. Looking this way, third. Fourth and fifth. Sådan som jeg havde det på 5 minutter siden, så dårligt har jeg aldrig haft det. Jeg mener, det er... Jeg har aldrig haft det så dårligt i mit liv. Og det er lige meget om det har været en fucking bytur af alkohol, da man gik i gymnasiet og var helt ødelagt. Jeg har aldrig prøvet at have så voldsom kalme, hvor hele kroppen er meget ryster, så jeg kunne slet ikke være mig selv. Det var sådan... Fuck, det er ubehageligt. Virkelig. Men det er den måde, man lærer at rykke sine grænser på, hvor du er sindssygt. Den der skraldespærer, jeg stod over ved, og skulle kaste op i, den lugtede bare, du ved. Det var som om jeg kunne lugte, der en enkelt ting, der lå dernede. Og så vendte hele min mave, og så var jeg Det lugtede bare ligesom sådan en skraldespærer, der jeg gik i folkeskole, hvor alle lige havde smidt noget af deres madpakke ud. Sådan en masse gammel levkostejsmad og lort. Fuck, mand. Virkelig ulækkert. Jeg står bare og kigger lidt bag. Oh, 
Det var ikke hårdt. Det var bare fordi ham der dyven, og det er ikke engang løgn her. Ham der dyven, der, der så spotte mig i en anden side. På det andet sæt, så, så bøvser han. Og bare resten af sættet, der lugtede fucking af bræk. Altså sådan, jeg har lyst til at smadre ham. Det var så fucking ulækkert. Og sådan lige når man sådan prøver at få vejret og sådan noget. Jeg har aldrig prøvet noget så fucked. Jeg har lyst til at græde. Det er fucking underligt. Sådan for real, jeg har lyst til at græde. Det er helt væk. Fuck mig, mand. Åh, oh, det er ulækkert. Killing, the killing. Det er det, det er killing. Ej, Mila sagde også, what have you said pussy in Danish? Well, I don't know, other than killing. <laughs> nah, you did fucking good. I like you too, Mila. You're a nice guy when you yeah, don't listen, have to play tough. Listen, this I appreciate the fact that you guys came all the way from there and you let me expose you to the highest level of training, okay? Yeah, that's the whole purpose of it. Uh, you've seen, I mean, the back, I didn't baby you. I, I put you to the heavy stuff. I choose the you know torturous thing. Today I didn't I skipped the squats because I was afraid if I do the squat the lower back my freak but so by the time you come here you can do it and I want you to experience this. Okay. There was a couple more. The leg press was busy. I wanted to do really uh, high uh, reps leg press and then turn it around the other way. The, the machine and then uh, go slow this way. Okay. I mean, there is uh, many ways to skin the cat, right? Uh, you know, uh, so for you as a coach, if you're gonna expose somebody to, to this, if you're not gonna train that, I wish you train like this. You so know. you think we should train like this every time? Yeah? Okay, listen, if you train like this for a month, then you can come and we can talk. You would become such a machine. Body is adaptive mechanism, right? So you can adapt to this, or you can adapt to that. Every day, you're adapting it to more, 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 more. How do you get in the super condition? How do you get the super strong? Yeah, this is how. Of course, now you have to rest and feed and everything else. Yeah. Of course. So I'm sure that tomorrow, you don't want to do anything after this kind of work. Right, we'll probably take a rest day tomorrow. <laughs> I love you too. You fucking love you. When you uh, before weekend came after the belt squat, I did it in the, the garbage can. And then, then you said, "Come over, come over." I said, all right, all right. Back in the day, I would have a guys do the hack squats and a puke and rack. No, 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 and rack. Finish the set. You know, puke all over. I didn't let them finish. Okay. Have to finish the set, then you can go. But this is another <laughs> feeling because I'm used to when you train legs that you feel a little sick and you yeah. can throw. But this is it's out of the body. You're just shaking like. Okay. And like Josh said, when I was standing outside, like I really I want to cry. 
<laughs> it's hard to explain. Do you have a like little feminine side about you, right? I, I do. Yesterday have. you had a period. I'm very, today, I'm very right? sensitive, actually. Uh, the most important thing is you guys survived, okay? <laughs> Anders did everything. Probably. Yeah. Probably. You you escape, okay? You escape because uh, man. Uh, you still have it in you. That last set of hacks, what? You still have it in you, right? And uh, yeah, for you, but if if you are about to puke, I understand to stop. But I wish you just finished it. <laughs> you know the solution to your condition? It's just Selena has to to work you more. <laughs> Don't surprise her and move. She's, she's just smiling just, behind uh, the camera. Just be like uh, like this. Eh? <laughs> okay, so this was crazy. I admit it. Scale down a little bit. But challenge yourself, you know. I would definitely like the. You guys did very good on those super slow. All three of you. The first set over there, beautiful. Not too many people do it that slow and all the way. So this is very impressive. I wanted to do a little bit heavier there, but uh, I wanted you to survive everything. The bounce squats are pretty good. You know, you can go heavy. I mean, I know that. Okay, the three plates. Initially, first rep, you were a toe shift, you can, but then you did 12. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So physical, it's not good. Yeah, it is. When I was standing, before the first rep, I was like, I cannot do this. I, I don't, I don't want to go down, and then I was like, yeah. fuck it. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so for me as a coach, I know your strength, I've already seen it. And you're like, should, should I say, pushing out. So I can, okay, come back tomorrow, or do it. I promise you, okay, this is on camera. Back in the day when I trained with the Silvio, Johnny Jackson, the heater and stuff like that. And I watch, and Silvio was cheating. Okay, you say going super slow, super slow, right? Is it? Yeah, Silvio. One, you know, warning. Second warning, third warning. No. I take him under the arm, I kick him out of the gym. Oh, he wants to finish it. No, no, no. You can't finish it now. You're gonna come back next day when you're ready to train. Who was that, Silvio? Silvio, yeah. I kick him out. And he was a girl fighting. No, I gave you a chance because you are setting a bad example. Uh, look, you three musketeers, right? You came in here. One depend on the other ones. Uh, yes, you know, bad link. So if I were training for a contest and some of you guys fail, I will not let you come back. You didn't earn it. Earn it, right? So you gotta want it. That's the only way how you're gonna go to the top. If you compromise and you have excuse and you have why, a... Why are you pointing at me? <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. Yeah, there's such an excuse yesterday. Because <laughs> yeah. we talked about yesterday, we like to uh, incorporate this, this kind of training. Uh, and we, we already do it at home, but not for a whole workout. And then you see Regan today, he's not doing all the dances. So... Of course, well, why do you think he's not training with me right now? <laughs> you see yeah. And when we, when we come close to the contest, right now he's off of everything yeah. and it's okay, so you, cruise you, into you it. You would not train like this all year? I, I would. You would? I would. Even if you're on off season, because you guys said, do you eat a lot, do you put the... No. You want to get big, you want to get muscular. So you want to build more muscle and keep your a low body fat, right? Because if you do this, now I have to burn body fat. I hate burning fat. I was hitting... Uh, well, I don't want to do tons of cardio, I don't want to go low calories, so I was just keeping in shape. So if you train like this, carbs before, carbs into, carbs post, if you do the insulin, you have a, those two meals after, right? That's your carb time. The rest, I don't care. You can cut the carbs, you can have a deficit, but now it's time to grow. Now it's time to push everything. I mean, that's when you have, a, like guys like us, we don't have like genetics like Regan. But what, what, do you, what do you think we need to do to get to like the next level? Rich Gaspari didn't have a genetics, right? And he uh, got second place in Olympia Who? three times. Rich Gaspari. Uh, look, genetics is shape, okay? Shape. But muscle is muscle. Everybody can build muscle, right? You guys work very, very hard. If you're gonna give honest effort like this every single time you train, so you're maximizing stimulation. Then you do everything possible nutritionally. You maximize nutritional intake of everything that you need in timely matter. Quantity, quality, quantity, quality, and timely. You're gonna grow in that time. He has a crazy determination. Okay, and <laughs> you, you are, you know, listen, you're a little spoiled. No, you're a little spoiled <laughs> in sense of you don't wanna try 100%. Okay, you try, you know, can I say this? You wanna, you wanna fuck, but you don't wanna put it in. <laughs>
<laughs> and that's not called fucking, right? right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, what's the solution? Just go deeper? No, no, but, but listen, you just gotta want it. I mean, uh, you know, like he said, he was ready to quit. So I can't do this, but then you did 12 reps. Okay, so now me as a coach. I know you can do 12 reps, but you want to quit. So what are I supposed to do? Let you quit? See, if I get, let you quit, then uh, I'm not a coach. You know what I mean? Yeah, we, we come here to... Yeah, no, 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 but the fact is, not too many people can just come in and do this shit. I agree. I, what did I tell you two days ago? You're going to die on, uh, on a leg workout, you know? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so the plan was, I told him, the plan was to do the 30 reps and squats. And uh, uh, I... Yeah, three, uh, three, uh, at the end, and then I was going to do a little... Uh, uh, giant set here on hack squat uh, on uh, hamstring, stiff leg that lift, the triple drop on uh, this one, and then squeeze in. But that, that would be a full. Uh, yeah, that, would be, that, that was my initial plan. When you go in and you just you say you just do it on the goal, like you say, okay, now we can do this today. Maybe yeah. next week we can do more. Because uh, I seen you. You guys impressed the heck out of me in a in a back workout. That was crazy. So I had everything. I had a strength. I have a execution. In a, uh, endurance, mindset, you guys ever did everything. On the chest, as you know, I mean, I just show you some, uh, you know, little tricks and methods. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. Uh, chest is never an exhausting workout. It's never the same. But well, fuck, we feel it today. Yeah. Big time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, ours is also a fuck up workout, mm -hmm. but uh, it's not exhausting like this. This, is, uh, I knew that uh, it's going to be borderline. Are you going to finish or are you not going to finish? He was leading with example, that's, that's good. So if you go after him, you have to finish it. Uh, for you, I, I speak about this. Every human in every aspect of life, if they can choose maximum results, optimal, minimal, or something in between, we all want maximum. So you're already a trainer, right? Transformation coach, okay? Okay, so you're at that level. You want to lead with example, so you want to transform yourself. Your body is your best advertisement, right? So now, you also have to test the waters. How far can you go, right? I mean, listen, I'm not the leader, you know, that wants the followers. I, leaders wants to make other leaders. I think that you guys can create better workout than I, I put you today. If you now just think, what can I use from this and apply? This, this is what I want you to think, okay? So you can say, oh, Milos is crazy. He put us too much, okay. Reduce what you think was too much, but then emphasize something maybe Maybe I, I let you get away with the something. Okay, do fast. I'd much rather we we'll do it slower. Yeah, yeah. Shit like this, right? But the name of the game is maximum stimulation, maximum amount of muscle fibers, right? That's what I told you guys over there on the first day. You remember? Yeah, yeah that's right. On the targeting muscle group. So today, do I feel? Yeah, I trash your your quads. Hamstring, uh, uh, you know, we didn't really. I could have done a little bit more. But that's why I normally separate quads and hamstring. Uh, okay, you do that? I usually do because. Yeah. Because you, you see, after this, you don't want to fucking no, do no, nothing. No, no. Okay. Yeah. How, how many times do you think? Six, six trainings a week? If we do like this? Six days a week? Yeah. I do. Okay. I mean, I have so many guys that follow, as you told me. Jordan Peters, less is more. Two, one, two, two. Yeah, they, exactly. Yeah, four, yeah, yeah. How much do you do with Regan when he's in training? Days. Originally, we were doing twice a day. Yeah. Originally. Yeah. Okay. But because after the COVID, it says, he's the same like me. COVID. He wiped us out. I mean, he would come in, you can see in his eyes, you know, just wasted. And then, like today, okay. You, you know, when you were doing the hack squats, you were there. I wish you tried to finish it, you know, and I would push you. But, uh, like, Regan was so uh, fatigued. And if I tried to push him, I would feel guilty. So I let it get away. Yeah. With you, I, I kind of wanted to push it. <laughs> you know, because uh, you don't look too sick. You just, uh, you look like mentally, you, you didn't want to do it anymore. I was in Paris with him talking and some lady, like, you know, was squatting, squatting. And uh, every like so many minutes, he says something in French. Eh? And I was like, what is she doing? She was doing a thousand squats. Oh, crazy. Thousands of squats. I mean, you could do 100 if I really made you. you know? I thought 50 was enough. 50 was enough. Yeah. 50 was what crazy. do you think is the most important? Like, we do everything eccentric, concentric, loads, and all that. What do you think is the, the most important thing? Everything, yeah. Apply everything. Change the tempo. I mean, look, if you follow somebody's advice, why yeah, you follow? So I tell you, there's four, four uh, parts of the movement eccentric, 
the, the length in position, concentric to short in position. You can play with everything tempo-wise, from explosive to slow to super, peak contraction, you know, a variety, okay? Angles, stances, anything. I, I, I made you do slow, fast, slow, fast, slow, fast. Deadline is the biggest motivator. I was not ready for the pros, right? Mm. That's what I thought. So I went to the contest just to stand next to Albert Beckless and uh, somebody's gonna take a picture I'm gonna send to, you, to my country, right? I placed third. I qualified for Olympia in my first Audi. I didn't think I was good enough. I needed so much more improvements, but you have to start from somewhere. After I competed in this show, I did every show 91, every show 92, most of the show 93, right? I just do, 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 do. I never had an off season. Why would I have off season? Oh, so I can have an excuse to eat, get fat? Come on, seriously. Every single day, you can move forward, you can improve, you can progress. How? By lying to yourself? No. I didn't put in my mouth anything that doesn't belong. Protein, carbohydrates, fat, okay. And then if I really crave something, okay, I'm gonna have my craving, but I'm gonna reduce my other calories that day, right? I'm not into the cheat meals, you know. Cheat meals, I hate fat. When I see the fat, I don't like it. Only fat that I like is uh, milk fat, like cheeses and, uh, you know, this kind of shit. But fat? Why do you want fat? I was always uh, super high carbs and uh, super high protein. If I'm your coach, I would like to accelerate your metabolism. So you're burning, 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 okay? So I let you burn a little bit before and uh, there after the uh, close of tonight. But training, this is a time to grow. You are in the growing business. You're in the muscle business, you, right? But if you restrict, how are you gonna grow? That's why they tell you eat uh, burgers and eat 2,000 calories over your, no. You don't eat the 2,000 over. You eat uh, what you're supposed to at the time that you're supposed to. That's how I think. And you guys, anyway, you, you do the insulin anyway, right? You even diet on the lower calories, but you use the insulin during a pre and post, you're gonna Just insert the, everything. Guarantee. I'm gonna see you tomorrow, right? And on Wednesday? You're gonna turn Wednesday? I'm in the Wednesday. Yeah. <laughs> so but anyway, so much, if I don't see you. Okay. Yeah, nice to see you. Thank you so much. 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 Thank you so det, det har du jo, ja, det er fucking stærkt, det er fucking stærkt, det er fucking stærkt, men vi fik, vi fik det jo at vide. Jannik har styrken, jeg har, jeg har hjertet, og Josh har mig gang klip, men han vil ikke køre dybt. Nej, Josh, jo, Josh, Nej, han sagde, jeg gider ikke. Ja, 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 Josh han er typen, der smider tøjet, det var tøjet af hans, af hans kæreste, står der, kører den op og står med kæmpe bad på, og så tager han tøjet på igen, så stopper det der. Bro, ja, så er bro. Den, den er ikke engang inde at snuse. <laughs> jeg ved ikke, hvad han snakker om, om det er min løs, mand. <laughs> Ej, venner, tak for i dag. Jeg havde det fucking skidt undervejs. Der blev ikke snakket så meget. Men Milos, han er heldigvis fucking nice, som bare de andre videoer. Han snakker sindssygt meget. Så fuck, hvor får I meget gratis viden derude, som vi har betalt dyre domme for. På her, det er børneopsparing, det er pension, det er alt, der er blevet trukket ned for. Jeg har ikke råd til at tage på casino. Jeg har ikke råd til en skid, mand. Men uh, til gengæld så har vi fået nogle sindssygt oplevelser. Hallo, han sagde, at, altså, han sagde så meget af det, som vi tror på, mm. med at vi sådan, kører lean gains og sådan noget. Ja, det er bare, sådan, okay. læ bare læg dig på et ligevægtsindtag, og så lidt mere med timing, og så kan du altså godt bygge muskelmasse. Det, så, øh, det er fucking nice, jeg synes. Alle dem derhjemme, der siger, at man ikke kan smide fedt og bygge muskelmasse. Billers, han har sagt det, det kan man fucking godt. Husk at like, husk at subscribe, husk at kommentere. Vi ses til næste træning. Vi skal lige have lidt coach. Mave også, ikke? Ja, ja, mave. Og, og vi mangler baglov også. Ja. Specielt mave.